my loves welcome back to my channel my name is Maya this is your very first time here so y'all Amazon and I have created a very strong bond <laughs> um, since I got this house so we have another Amazon haul today if you guys do not know I do have my own Amazon storefront and here it is right here I'll go ahead and put the link here and in the description box so we got some home stuff some kitchen stuff some beauty stuff all types of different things from uh, Amazon that I want to share with you guys today before we hop into the video please make sure that you hit subscribe below if you have not yet so that you are updated when new videos come out also make sure you hit that notification bell as well so that you are updated when new videos go up. all right y'all so let's start in the kitchen the first thing that I picked up in this Amazon haul is this Frigidaire blender and I just thought this was so freaking cute it is a retro blender and it comes with multiple pieces so it comes with two different cups which are also you know what you actually blend your mixture with or in on the blender if that makes any sense child <laughs> But it comes with both of those. It comes with two different tops. One is like a gulping top and the other one with a straw. And then of course the piece that connects to the top or the bottom of the cup to mix it and then the actual base. When I saw this, I really loved it. I do not have a blender. I believe Jeff has a blender, but you know, this one is just so cute. <laughs> <laughs> that I just couldn't help myself. I was like, I need this. Jeff is putting together a little smoothie or protein smoothie. So he was actually the first person to use this and he absolutely loved it. It's super easy to use. And like I said, it looks super duper cute in the kitchen as well. Next, I got some more dishes. You guys do know that I have like the square or you know, more square dishes from Target that I use a lot. I felt like I wanted to do black too. Y'all know the colors in my home is white, black, cream and natural pretty much. So um, I figured, you know, let me get some black ones as well. And these were available on Amazon and I really love them. Now they're not the same material as the ones from Target. They're a little bit more plasticky if you wanna say. <laughs> <laughs> but they're really sturdy, very nice. It's 12 piece set, four bowls, four smaller plates, and four bigger plates. So I'm about to go ahead and use these to plate our beautiful meal because I did make some Hello Fresh for my family this morning. I'm gonna go ahead and start prepping this, but if you guys do not know what Hello Fresh is, Hello Fresh is a meal delivery kit service that does deliver fresh meals to your door weekly. I decided to make this creamy lemon chicken, and y'all, when I tell you this meal was amazing, one thing I love about HelloFresh meals is that they are extremely delicious, like so good. My family loves it every time that I cook them. But I love that you can customize your HelloFresh box. Like you can swap out a protein for a different one or you can even upgrade for a more luxurious experience or add a protein to a meal that's like veggie, right? So it gives you more variety and more options. Another thing I love about HelloFresh is that it helps you to save some coins. Signing up for HelloFresh subscription is up to about 72% cheaper than dining out at a restaurant or even grocery shopping for the week. And y'all know that I have been on a weight loss journey. Actually, your girl has lost about seven pounds. We're gonna get into that on the vlog this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> but I love the HelloFresh helps me to reach my goals. So not only do they have like veggie options or pescatarian options, they have fit and wholesome meals and recipes as well, which are like lower calorie foods. And you can eat healthier while not sacrificing the flavor that you get because the stuff is the bomb. Also with HelloFresh having pre-portioned ingredients sent straight to your door, you have less prep and less wasted food. HelloFresh has really helped me to learn how to cook and just kind of cook better. And I always keep the cards too, cause that helps me in other recipes that I'm making on my own as well. Now y'all know I gotta hook y'all up. Go to HelloFresh.com and use code MyGalore65 for 65% off plus free shipping. So you guys see how beautiful my food looks on these plates. I'm happy now that I have white and black plates as well. That way we can mix and match a little bit. It's not as boring, right? Think, so another thing that we got in the kitchen is this Ziploc bag organizer thing. So I've seen other influencers have this and I was like, I never, I, I don't have no need for that, right? Until Jeff, came to the house and he had this big like Ziploc box with like all the different sizes in it, like a jumbo pack. And I was like, this is an opportunity to make, get, give this a little aesthetic, right? So I found this on um, <laughs> Amazon and you just fit it right into the drawer and you can stick all of your bags of different sizes in that. And you know, I feel like getting rid of packaging, like all the colorful packaging from all the different, you know, retailers and stuff like that. Getting rid of those and kind of streamlining does make your home more aesthetically pleasing. You know what I'm saying? More put together, gives it more of a vibe. 
<laughs> and I do absolutely love that I did go ahead and purchase this now that I do have all the sizes. But if I'm being uh, completely honest, I usually don't keep all these different size bags in my house. I only did it because he brought it here, so I was like, might as well. <laughs> all right, y'all, let's move to my studio. Now, it has taken me a while to actually get in my studio, start moving things around, but I've been wanting to feel more inspired, so I was like, let's start hooking up the beauty room. First thing we did purchase is this clothing rack. You guys know I had two black clothing racks from Target, but I wanted to really brighten this room up and kind of make it light and airy. We do have a neon sign coming for this room as well, but I did love this clothing rack. I love that it allows me to like put decor on it as well as you know clothes I have some of my perfumes here a little bit of decor a candle I love the white in the wood of this it did take me a quick little second to put together it was was not the easiest because I feel like you needed two people but I got it done and I really really love the aesthetic that it brings to the studio next in the studio we did go ahead and purchase this light this mirror light for my vanity this is a 20 inch large mirror for your vanity table I actually wasn't aware it's gonna be this big I don't know why I saw 20 inches but I was thinking like a smaller like mirror if you guys see I put my hands up to it you can see how big it actually is the light on it is super duper bright I love it for my beauty room especially since my table is not facing a wall you know what I'm saying so I didn't want to get like a wall mirror to go up against the wall um, I felt like this was perfect and get, gives me more visibility of myself because I have been using a very small mirror it does have three different settings for brightness you can do something more yellow tone something more blue toned and then kind of like a neutral light it has been making me really excited to get in there do my makeup and you know just do my thing Last thing in the studio that we did get off Amazon on this round is this rug. It is like a braided jute rug. The color of it is off white and it is an eight by 10, so eight feet by 10 feet rug. And it is absolutely beautiful. Um, I. I bought this initially to go in my front sitting room, but it's gonna take a while for me to figure out what I want to go on in that room, the furniture and stuff like that. So I was like, well, I just have the random rug sitting down there when I could put it to good use, especially since I'm trying to put my studio together to get more inspiration, right? I went ahead and dragged it up the stairs, brought it into the studio, and I absolutely love it for this room. Rugs just do something to you to just like tie everything together. You know what I'm saying? And right now I'm doing finishing touches like that throughout the house, so I'm really happy with this rug. I love it. So I also picked up some velvet hangers, y'all. So you guys know that I do all black velvet hangers. Usually I would pick up big like packs of them from like Marshalls or Home Goods, but they're kind of hard to find. Sometimes I have them, sometimes I don't. And I am already busting out of my walk-in closet. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, I need some more hangers and I want them all to match. So I did find these on Amazon. Um, a few other Amazon storefronts that I follow had these on there. And I was like, okay, these are probably really good and I do love them. They're almost identical to the ones that I already have that I bought from Home Goods and Marshalls. And I personally love a good velvet hanger because I feel like your clothes just stick to it. They don't fall, it doesn't slip. Um, and it's just also a very sleek look as well. I bought this in a set of 60 and the hook part does rotate as well. That's also good for me because I like all my stuff facing the right, the same direction. Very extra, very unnecessary child, but <laughs> I do. <laughs> Next, I got one thing for the bathroom. So, in the bathroom, I did get a waterproof speaker, y'all. I love to listen to music when I am showering, when I am in my bathroom, when I'm in my bathtub. And I have other portable speakers, but I did not have one that was waterproof that is in the shower. This one is from SoundBot. It is water resistant and it's Bluetooth. You also can answer the phone on it. It has a built-in mic and speaker on it as well. I wanted to put it along the back wall of my shower, but it wouldn't suck to it because it's a suction cup. So I had to put it on the glass area. That's why it's on my door in my bathroom versus like on the wall. But regardless, it has a beautiful sound. It's nice and loud and I get to bang out with the vibes. <laughs> 
<laughs> while I'm in the shower and I love that. Next, let's get into a few home decor items. I did get this beautiful reed diffuser. I absolutely love the look and vibe of this. Like, I love the reeds and I love the little flowers, but even if I'm not feeling the flowers, you can just easily take the flower ones out and it just gives more of a modern look, you know? The flowers kind of add kind of a girly vibe to it. Black Cherry is by Culture and Nature and it smells absolutely amazing. Um, it did say that if, you know, I don't know if you guys have had a reed diffuser before, this is my first time, but it said that, you know, once the scent kind of dies down, you can just flip the reeds and then, you know, you'll kind of get that scent and aroma back. So right now I do have it sitting on my console table where my underneath my mirror, which all of this is still a very much a work in progress, but I think it's absolutely beautiful. Right next to that is this beautiful decor piece that I picked up on Amazon. And it's just a simple wooden knot, like whitewashed wooden knot, but I think it's so freaking cute. It was only about $20 and I love this just to sit, you know, on something next to something just to add a little bit more elegance, a little bit more modern decor, whatever, you know, else you got going on. And I, I love this little knot. She's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I picked this up on Amazon and this is one of my favorite decor pieces I would say that I picked up on Amazon thus far. While we're talking about home decor, I did want to mention um, if you guys watched my video where I did my office and my custom art, I do have an art light that I picked up at Amazon. I'm gonna go ahead and throw it on the screen so you guys can see it. You can just screw it to the wall and like hook it on. This one is chargeable. It's easy to just hook it off and take it down, charge it and pop it back on. It has a little button on the side where you can put the light on and off. And then you also can twist the head of it to you know move in what direction you want the light to hit. I have it right over the painting that Jeff Amir and I made together for this wall. And as you can see, it just adds a little bit of elegance, a little bit more high-end vibes. <laughs> I fell to the wall, I'm, don't mind me y'all, I'm actually looking at it right now, but I just love it. I think it looks really good and I really love that light. I am thinking about getting some more of those lights. Um, a few of you guys suggested that I put them over my art on the wall in my office um, for like an evening vibe. So I'm thinking about doing that as well, as well as getting some more throughout the house. So I have one more thing I wanted to show you guys, but Unfortunately, it was a little smaller than I was expecting it to be. And that is this mirror, y'all. Um, this mirror right here, I love the shape of it. I have been wanting to pick up like an abnormally shaped mirror ever since I saw my girl Janae from High Look High Low Lux. In her home, like by her door, she has a like abnormal shaped mirror. And I was like, that's so cute. I really want one of those. And my butt ordered this without looking at the size of it. <laughs> And it's so small, like, mission not accomplished. But I just still wanted to mention it. I'm gonna find a place for this, but I am gonna be on the lookout on Amazon for one that is a little bit bigger. If you like a smaller, um, you know, awkward sized or shaped mirror, this one's perfect for you. <laughs> if you have a smaller space or a more narrow wall that you wanna put it on, this is perfect. But I'm gonna be looking for one that's a little bit bigger than this, but, I want to at least show you guys the one that I did get. <laughs> I just feel like it's gonna look super cute for selfies, like on the wall, like with your phone, and just to have that odd shape. So yeah, still on the lookout for one. If you found one, give me a link <laughs> on Amazon um, so I can check that out. All right, babes, so that wraps it up for today's video. Don't forget to follow my Amazon storefront. I'll leave the link again right here and in the description box so that you guys can check out all of my Amazon finds in one place. And it's all categorized for you, so you ain't really gotta search too much. If you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. Comment below, let me know what you thought. Also, make sure you hit subscribe below if you have not yet. And I will see you guys on Sunday. Bye.